Hi and welcome, Kat from Sacred Soul Rising. So I got this question asked and I really wanted to make a video about it because I didn't want to answer it in just a few words. The question was is, I have now been doing your Twin Flame course, Kat. I have now magnetized in my other self. But when we are in communication, when we are chatting and talking, I often feel quite sick and dizzy and my twin has also mentioned that sometimes they feel absolutely exhausted too. Why is this? Well, it's a really simple answer. As you are learning how to balance the energy, it can feel very overpowering. Remember, you are one energetic system. So you're the same soul frequency, the same soul essence, the same soul signature. As you are learning how to balance in the 3D, because this connection is a connection at soul level. You're one energetic system, you're one soul. And everything that happens with this connection is not really of earth bound. Yes, because you are in a human body and because you met in physical form, you will initially see it as two individuals, two souls, but you're one system. And so that's why when you have had that separation phase, and that's why twins cannot do the main work and why I always say separation is preparation because that is in separation is when the healing occurs. Now, when you bring in those reunions and you're starting and you're learning how to balance the shared energetic field and remember Divine Feminine, you're the leading twin in this. So you lead and you have to self-master that third energy as well so you're learning how to balance and while ever you get into that triggering energy or that energy that pushes you into that runner chaser triggering energy runner chaser energy or any toxic energy it will make you feel sick it will make you feel almost like a little bit delirious and it can also make divine masculine feel this as well at those times, it is when you need to pull back your energy and come back in and center it. Knowing that the longer that you're able to work through this and you take it slowly, you take it gently, the longer you will be able to hold that energy together. And when I say together, I mean as that one energetic frequency. This journey of balancing your other self back in takes time. It's not a quick energy. And what I also want to remind you is that you always need to be in soul frequency when you are balancing them back in. If you get into mind and ego, a mind and ego will feel very triggering. Mind and ego will start you questioning and start you being in that toxic frequency. If you're in that, you need to pull your energy all the way back. Make excuses, you know, say you're busy, but you need to pull it back and you need to center self. Remember, this is a soul journey. It's not a mind and ego journey. When you're balancing the frequency, it takes time. If you need more help and support um, to delve deeper into this and to understand how you balance them in over the time, then my Twin Flame course is there. Everything is there on my website to help and support you through the journey. I send you so much love, many blessings.